no way. How much on the belts? First time finding games at the flea market in a long time. Let's go. I just wanna toy hunt. I just wanna toy hunt. I just wanna toy hunt every day. Every day. All right, guys, it's early and we just scored big. I'll tell you guys what I got and the prices at the end of the video. Smash that like button. We're here at the flea market. And we're doing a toy hunt. I collect things old, new, retro action figures, movies, all types of stuff. So hit that like button, subscribe if you are new here. And uh, oh, I gotta get back to looking, let's go. So this is my first time here at the flea market since I'm a dad. I'm a new dad for anyone just jumping on. And uh, all this is empty. I'm glad I didn't come too early today. Oh my God, they have wrestling belts. Hold on. How much on the belts? You can do uh, 500 eight. rupees. Huh? Eight. 500. Eight 500 each? I know you yeah. want. Give me eight. 500 each. That's like a gizzard each. Okay. Guys, 500 each. You guys paying 500 for these? Each, too, not not just one each. I would say maybe a hundred each, but damn. You blew it! If you pass later, maybe I give you a oh. I, I have another one. Oh, yeah. All right, yes. Oh, enjoy. Thank you so much. No problem. Right, okay. I used to find those belts. I found some wrestling belts, those official ones, at the flea market for 25 ones back in the day. Everything now is scalper prices you might as well stay at home and shop ebay so oh, a lot of movies over here. how about how much on this guy could you do a dollar yeah yeah okay uh do you have any more like open figures not in the box stuff uh, those are a little too cutesy for me i like you know the real looking guys you know okay yeah i mean uh, how much on the video games? Uh, I'll go Dollar, uh, I'll take this one too. And then, what are your movies? Dollar? Dollar? Okay, I like it. All right, I'll take it. Oh, Freddy Got Fingered, good movie. <laughs> I said, that movie. <laughs> it's a good movie, right? You like that one? He's crazy, man. Yeah, he is. Well, you know, I'll a dollar? Yep. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, I'll take that. Um, hmm. What do you want on the trading cards? Uh, five bucks for a whole pack. Yeah, all right, I'll take a look. I'm a homeowner, so I'm also looking for like furniture and stuff. Oh, here's toys. Oh, hero clicks. You could do something big with these hero clicks, but I'm I'm okay. Oh, look, a singular wireless sign. I'm glad I didn't come too early because there's still not a lot of people. I did get some good stuff so far. Oh, all right, definitely some stuff that we could flip for profit. That train's going. That train's going bonks right now. missing a disc guys those older games if something's missing a disc it's usually not worth it because then you're gonna have to track that thing down this guy says two for a dollar now sometimes you could get crazy with the plushes but you have to really know about them or else you're gonna be sitting on some dirty used plushes i don't buy them unless i know them all right we're gonna have to move on from this just doing a quick run right now I just remembered I gotta get something over at the guy in the front row okay cool I just remembered good good make sure you're smashing that like button make sure you're smashing that like button and make sure you're hitting the subscribe button
for more content like this. Look at that gumball machine right there. That's pretty cool. I have a Batman one. Ooh, what's that? The guys behind me are both listening to the same radio station on their radios across from each other. So you get like this 3D music experience, which is interesting. This guy used to get some really amazing stuff, but he hasn't been getting anything good in a long time. I used to get some crazy stuff from that guy. I want those wrestling belts so bad. That guy was asking 500 each. What? Insanity, he wasn't even budging either. That guy stinks as a seller. Cool. 90 bucks, I could buy a mule. Oh. How much on the She-Hulk? 20. 20? Probably like 30 bucks, 35 bucks. Yeah. So we're here and there's so many empty spots, man. It's crazy. I'm glad I haven't been coming too early because then you're just really seeing nobody here. There is a guy that sells spray paint and that's what I'm trying to get right now. If I leave here with some spray paint for a really good deal, then I'll be happy. So if you've been watching my flea market videos for a while, I used to have a segment where I said people's flea market quotes back. And someone, some guy just said, in life, man, if you ain't the fly, you're the windshield. And I'm still, I'm not sure really what that means yet. What do you guys think that means? Flea market wisdom. Perfect. Now, I, I normally don't ever check down here, but it seems like there's new people and it seems like this is where everyone is. So I'm gonna actually check down this road for once. Let's do it. We got younger flippers over here, digging. I wonder what they're looking for. Oh shit, it's you, what's up? What's going on, I was bro? talking what? on my uh, YouTube right here and I knew you. I said, there's some <laughs> flippers over here. I wonder what they're looking for. You already know. Me. You already know. Oh, this is pretty good. CD holder thing. I've been collecting CDs, believe it or not. All right, okay. They got some old comics right here. So I'm not seeing the spray paint guy right now, but I'm gonna look maybe somewhere else. I just did some asking around. Spray paint guy left early. The people leave early so I don't have to pay for the table, even though it's like two bucks. <laughs> Another thing I'm looking for casually is the uh, Fast and Furious box set. I started rewatching those movies and uh, I kind of want to get the DVDs here cheaper than like $60 at uh, Target. Good thing I got that early table because I scored and now I'm just kind of looking around for something. But uh, I already got my score. Let's see Blu-rays over here. CDs and Blu-rays. What's that? Oh, I thought that was a toy. It's, it's a forks. What? First time finding games at the flea market in a long time. Let's go. <laughs> Guys, we scored today. So I actually got video games and I cannot believe it. For the first time in like a while that guys we're gonna go over everything i got and all the pricing and all that stuff look at this i got this back to the future hoverboard from loot crate normally the loot crate stuff is garbage but this is actually like a pretty sought after one fifth scale replica it's got a glass it hovers it's actually really nice i'll take a look at that later these disney plushes are hit and miss this looks like let's see 2005 he has a scythe i'm sure they don't do scythes anymore Walt Disney World, always look for the theme park. See, theme park edition. So uh, this is probably something. I'm gonna have to look that up. I actually couldn't find anything on this, but it's from 2005. It's the Happy New Year plush of Figment. So that's gotta be something. I couldn't find anything, not even on Google. That's gonna take some more digging. It's a Game of Thrones convention exclusive replica shield. This goes for like 20, 30 bucks, not bad. We got a figure. We got the DC Direct Sand, uh, Scarecrow, not Sandman, Scarecrow. I think this is the Alex Ross one. I'm pretty sure this is from Kingdom Come. But uh, yeah, we got that. We got, this is cool. So uh, this is old Disney. Like any type of these things could be either something crazy or something decent. So he has a little tag, tail that wags. 
this is probably something nice. I'll be putting all the, the things on the screen because we buy stuff cheap so we could flip it. Now here's some cool movies we got. The original Flash. This is the dad in that new Flash. Look, there's more camel right there. This is sealed and it's a complete set. So I don't know, that could be maybe 10 to 20 bucks. This is, oh, this is sealed. Okay, I bought this for me, but we have Turtles 1, 2, and 3 on Blu-ray triple feature, but sealed. I didn't even notice it was sealed. Ultraman. I don't know. I, I like to buy these anime movies because sometimes they're uh, limited here, you know, and it was still sealed. So I got that movie. And this is all from the same person because there was no one else that had stuff. And then we have these vintage peel and stick wall things. I just love the old superheroes, man. This reminds me of something that would be in Six Flags Great Adventure at the end of the Superman ride. Pretty old. It's definitely from the 90s or 2000s, but uh, I had to pick this up. Become a channel member, help out these videos if you like them and you want more. All right, enough, let's get into videos. So this, and again, anything I get, if you guys want, just hit me up on Instagram, Twitter, or it'll most likely all be on my Macari. Just let me know that you watch the show and I usually throw in some extra stuff, give a discount or here and there, whatever. Now, this is awesome. The first time I got video games in a long time. Now, these are all like, these are basically like 10 buck game, around $10 games, not bad, Qbert. Pac-Man. This is like a $20 game-ish. And then here's where I won. I knew when I saw this, first of all, I love Street Fighter. Perfect. I love Street Fighter's art, like that old Capcom art. Like, look at this. The chibi, the Capcom chibi art. This thing is like mint too. I got to be very careful with it. Ah, be careful. Hold on guys. Look at that. That art right there alone. I don't like chibi stuff, but when Capcom did it, look how amazing that is. Oh, look at that. I want posters of this. Minty, this thing's worth 40 bucks, but I think I actually might keep that because it's just too cool and it'll only go up. Street Fighter is just amazing. And then we have the black label Spyro, which around is around like 30 to 40 bucks. This one got a beat up case, so I'll probably just take it from like one of these like Qbert, you're gonna have to sacrifice your case because nobody cares about Qbert. But again, not bad, paid a buck each for all of this. Now let me know, did I did I score? I only got one person, it was pretty dead there, but that's all you need sometimes. You just gotta get lucky on one table and I left and I still made it before my wife and kid even woke up and we're gonna have breakfast. So let me know what you guys think. Leave a comment down below. If anyone wants any of this, hit me up or check out my Macari and I'll see you in the next toy hunt. Good luck on your hunts, guys. Peace. What the? What the? I just found all of this under the shelf. Oh my God. Have a product that you want to see opened on the channel? My P.O. box is down below. For anyone who wants to send stuff in, everything gets opened up on video. If there's a specific figure that you want to see reviewed that I did not review, or you have a letter you want to send in, or even some fan art, everything gets opened up on video. Leave a comment down below, hit that like button, and I'll see you in the next video.